Welcome back everyone to my fourth installment of my Total War Attila Radius Mod playthrough. So far it has been all out war. Alright, so I was just looking at all this before I started recording, but I am on all my borders here to the north with Judea and then to like the northeast with the Sassanids and then to the south I'm at war with I think it's Yatmazun and then the Aksum. So all my borders are at war. It's a uh, pretty surprising. I thought it would take a lot longer than this to get to this point. If uh, if I could be at war with the sea over here, I probably would be. If if I could fight the sea, they probably would have declared war on me as well. So I have a lot of a lot of things to juggle right now. A lot of battles to plan. I'm hoping I can get this army back to full strength, get a garrison force, and maybe start pushing back on the Sassanids. I don't think Judea is going to invade, but now that I said that, they probably will send two stacks my way next turn. Uh, I had besieged Zafar in the last episode, but it's glitched out. You can kind of see he's kind of besieging it, and it's on fire. When I click on him, he can move and do stuff. I don't know if that's supposed to be that way. I thought when it's under siege, there should be a little siege towers and catapults, so I'm going to click that again. Okay, so I guess I'm just used to Rome 2, where when you besiege someone, it spawns little catapults and stuff. I guess it doesn't do that in this one. Um, but yeah, so I'm hoping I can take Zafar next. They have four turns until they start suffering attrition. I'm assuming that's what that means. Turns remaining before garrisons will run out of supplies for. So, Oh, he has an unassigned skill. Didn't know this. So this is the governor of my of Arabia Magna. So I probably would want to look and see what they have a public order problem right now. It's probably because I just had to take Hira, or not Hira, Dumatha. I had to fight back and forth to get them. And it's religious differences as well. Uh, Alright, well let's go back to him. So, public order problems. So, authority will help with that. So, let's go ahead and do... I can also get a food bonus. I'll do the authority first, and next time he levels up, I'll do this one to get some food. And maybe some of these other skill trees. Okay. End turn. Oh my god, he still has another one? I thought I'd... I guess I can't read. Apologize for that. But, so I've been thinking a lot this past week about what I can really do. And I'm just going to have to fight all these battles. I'm going to try to be the last one standing. Hopefully I can do that. <laughs> I don't know. Why would they do that? What, what do they gain from attacking me? Um... I really don't want to fight this right now. Because then next turn they can just attack me and I'll be whittled down. Like I could win that fight, but the Mizun could attack me as well. <sighs> that is why I always say you got to take two stacks. You can't just do one. And because of all the wars, I've been forced to take one stack and send it all over the place. But I need to consolidate my forces. Bad. So I don't know if you guys saw that. But they attacked them. Now all these forces are destroyed. Okay. I'm going to attack uh, this army then next, or this turn. Get rid of them. It'll probably pull in the garrison force for Zafar. Then I can take that in one turn. Let me see if I can hinder this army at all. I'll try to misdirect it. My failure, <sighs> failure come on. It was a 50-50 shot. How do you fail that? And that's a Mizun army. 
That is massive. At your command. They need some more swords. Are you ready to serve? Um, that's a lot of mercenary defectors. How do they get those? How do they recruit those? All right, I'm just gonna move through this. So they're oh, they end up withdrawal. Yep, raiding. So these guys are raiding down here. I'd love to get rid of them and resolve the food shortage here. So now is that one food? Okay. Damn, this is really a cursed ass <laughs> area. Okay, so I'm gonna do this. Let's attack them. I'm gonna fight it just because I wanna make sure. Ah, I mean, it shows I'm pretty. I'm pretty much gonna destroy them. Maybe I'll do a protective. No, I'm gonna fight it. I'm gonna fight it. I think I can lose less troops if I fight it. Let's have a dry, clear day. And that's perfect. So, what I'll do... I think I'll send. So that'll be group one. I'll have the swordsmen be right behind them. As group two. The cavalry flank from the right side since that's more hilly. It'll hide them. And then, I can't remember. Can these guys move? I think they can move. They have wheels. Yes, so I'll have them kind of move up slowly. And I'll keep my general off to the right as well. Okay. So when everybody move, I would like to get you in front of that hill. If I can. The enemy approaches. Reinforcements. And there's a little elephants. I actually saw a comment in one of the Reddits that showed uh I don't know if it was the elephants or deer. I can't remember. They showed one of the animals in Rome too, and that reminded me. Yeah, they have these little, these little guys in all the games. Look at them just go. They're just having fun. I got a screenshot of the little elephants. It looked like they were having a blast. Yeah. I'm gonna do a flaming round because fuck them. Stop where you're at right now, you're within range, and fire at will. Raiders. And then having you guys hide, you'll obviously hit them from the sides. So, let's have you come out now. And then I think I'll want you guys to just charge. So, I'll let them get a little closer. We are at your command. What are your orders? Dodge! For glory! For glory! Faith and create! For glory! I do. Advance! We'll have you guys attack from the, the ba- The ba- Can't even speak. From the back. You guys will charge and hopefully try to break some from behind. Let me see if I can get a good shot in. Oh, this is going to be tough. Perfect. I may just have them. guys pull back farther you come in to take care of him while they're pulling back
General is under attack. Yeah, yeah. There you pull off more that way. Yeah, I don't think these guys are going anywhere. Alright. The enemy general is dead! Come over here just to throw your projectiles at him from the sides. They'll break in a second. But I shut okay, I was making sure. I didn't want any friendly fire. Charge and the rest of them should break with that. Yep, there we go. The day is yours. So go ahead and run the rest of them down. I'll speed this up a little bit. Just because I want to make sure that there's like none remaining. Yeah, and they're going to try to retreat that way. Are they actually getting through? Oh no, those are my guys. So there's one defector who just got stabbed through the side. Alright. Beautiful. That actually was perfect. That actually... I don't think that could have went any better. 88 losses. I pretty much eradicated all their forces. I should be able to waltz right into that, uh, that city now. I don't need to replenish because I'll be taking this. I didn't check their integrity and the 570 isn't worth it, so I'll kill them. My lord. And I'm pretty much right, yep. Occupy. We fight for you, my lord. <laughs> because they have a massive amount of food consumption stuff. That is very interesting. I don't know if I can demolish that. It's the dam over there. I didn't realize that. Is there a way I can change it so it's not... Huh, I don't know. I can get rid of... Well, yeah, I can get rid of that. There's a bad omen, outraged populace, and the, uh... I have an army recruitment thing, so Ready let me see if I can orders. get... I could probably use some archers. Noble cause requires noble men. And upgrade those cavalry units. And that's beautiful, because these guys aren't doing anything. I mean, I could... Oh, I can't attack them this turn. Yeah, this one army, one force, is proving to be pretty strong. Okay, now... Yep, they're suffering attrition. So what I should do... Let's fortify them. So that they can't attack them and cause them to retreat. Well, they could, but they, they're they going to have a fort, which I would like for them to have. I think that's actually a really good spot I'm in right now. Perfect. I'm so happy. <laughs> I was so worried about this siege. I, I wasn't sure how I was going to be able to get it done. I don't need to upgrade that yet. I need to fix some of this stuff. This adds a fertility bonus to the province. Yeah, I need to do something to figure out what I can do to fix that. How do I check to see what it's actually, like this city is actually producing? Now see, that's just the whole... Because it should be producing 40 food from the animal husbandry, then 8 per fertility level. And if the fertility level is 6, 8 times 6, yeah, I'm getting screwed over. What, why am I not getting the fertility food? Maybe it'll go into effect next turn, or maybe I'm not getting that because this isn't a part of my faction. Who knows? We'll find out next turn. Oh, and some rebels spawned. Awesome. Yeah, they uh they tried to besiege me 
and yeah, that's not going to work well. Oh no! Uh, I knew one of these would come eventually. I should be able to still win this even with the massive amount of troops they have. We'll see. This is going to be tough as hell. Oh, and this is my... Is this my prince? Oh, man. Oh, man. <sighs> I only have one barricade. Well, the good thing is I do have enough troops I can try to do choke points at the, uh... At the watchtowers. On the frustrating part is where their reinforcements gonna come from. And then where should I put my barricades up? Alright. I think what I'm gonna need to do They they seem to have some archers. Some Persian bowmen. So I need to see if they're going to sit back and fire on me. I can take care of those Onagers. Onagers. Ah. I can use my light cavalry for that. Have them wait over here. And after everyone moves, take them out. The problem is, again, the reinforcements. They're going to have a lot of reinforcements coming in. Okay. We'll get some heavy spearmen there. I'm thinking... Well, let me... Uh, maybe I'll have to put it there then. Which doesn't really help me. I would like to make sure they can't come around this way. I'd really like to put a barricade here. They, they give the barricade spots. Yeah, you know what? I'll do that one. There. That'll force them to come through some ways. So then, these archers I can have kind of here, fire on both sides. Maybe I'll have some spears there. That still seems like a bad spot. Spears ready! Is that all my spear troops? Are they all in place? Okay, I still got one back here. He's in place, he's in place, he's in place. Okay, now for the melee infantry. Man, I were start. Damn, I'm still struggling if I should try to hold them here or let them all get in a single line. Because I really do think these watchtowers help a lot. They they annihilate them. Hmm. I guess we'll see. You know, they can't attack all of them. They're going to have to choose, and I'm, that may play to my, to my benefit. So you know what? I'm going to assume they're probably going to send a good amount of their guys this way. So I'll put more of my infantry over there. And the shittier ones I'll kind of have on reserve back here. I want to save the special troops for an emergency. The cavalry will be flanking the whole time. I hate that they're going like long way. Can I have you guys outside? No, I can't. I can have you right there. Alright. Now to place the rest of the archers somewhere. 
Again, I'm going to assume they're going to send most of their forces this way. Can I get you a little closer? Since they're that way, I'll have them there so they can fire there. The slingers, I would still like to have on reserves. Um, who, what unit is this? Another armored cav. And then I should have two general units. Again, I'll save those. And I'll have four more spearmen coming in. Oh, from that way. Mm, that's going to be tough. Alright. Let's, let's just see where it happens. Where their reinforcements comes in is crucial, because if they come in this way, I'm, I'm just totally fucked. Okay, so they're coming from that way. And they left those, so I can come here. Let's pray to God this spearman can get here in time. The enemy approaches. He's going that way. There's nowhere he can go. I'm not sure where they're firing. Looks like it must be this unit. See, the watchtower is just going to be so important. Are these guys on fire at will? Give them flaming shot as well. See, these guys are going to have to have probably flank and do a lot of action. Just anything I can do to whittle their forces down. Fire on him if you can, or fire on the cataphracts. And same with you guys, try to fire on the, the men that are far off. Get you over here. You guys might be able to take on all those camel warriors. You two, come over here. Try to take care of some of those. Oh, they destroyed it. Oh, get back. Ah, uh, I took my eyes off him for one second. The enemy is attacking our general. See, and the, the spearmen over here are going to take care of a lot of this cav. I knew it. They're going to have some of them. Where is... Okay. Those are all the scouts. Come out this way. Take care of them. I'll keep the spearmen with you guys. Enemy units have been rallied. Maybe those spearmen can take care of that troop. You. Oh no, my general's going too far. I'm gonna need you guys to cause some mass panics. Chieftain. 
Let's get you back in here. Take care of them. Yep, I knew it. There's still going to be some coming from that way. You guys will take care of those units. What I need you to do is come over here and relieve those guys. You. You. Uh, I didn't click on him. Come on, surround him and get him to break. Where's the other one? No. Come back. You guys were going too far. I gotta be careful about where I click because then they chase after them. Uh, I can't have them chase after him. He's gonna get caught up. I need you guys to actually like, get in here now. Oh, I'm so close. Our men flee the field of battle. This is a shameful display. Yeah, thought maybe they'd fire a little bit. Um, I need you to get back in here. What are your orders? You go help them. Broken and are fleeing. Where? Okay, yeah. These guys should be falling so much faster. Actually, I need a couple of you to keep going that way. Enemy units have rallied and returned to the battle. I need the armored, armored cab. Get out of there. You need to get in there, and then you guys just need to try to hit them, break them repeatedly. The enemy general is dead. Actually, you guys get back in there too. You can take care of the defectors and make sure nobody's chasing anybody. All right, come on. Pull back out. You get them. You guys line up there. Pull back. Um, you guys will come around this way. Try to come through here. Raiders! They're so close to breaking. The 
The men have thrown down their weapons and are fleeing! The archers may be able to hold those guys off. Okay. Charge again from behind. And peel back. What happened to the other guys? There they are. Uh, I'll wait. Alright, you three, come here. No, where are you going? Oh. It's whatever. I think I need you guys to come in here as well. Because now you guys, it's your turn to do some charging. I'd like to have you really take care of them. I think you're clear. Where'd my other armor come? My unit has used all its ammunition. Yes, you keep chasing them out of here. Get back in here. I'm saving him, that other general. Oh, I need to pull these guys out. Oh, I might have this. Our men have given up and are running for their lives. You guys come over here. Now you can chase down those bowmen. Come back in here. Yes, yes. Just take them all down. You go that way. You go that way. an archer unit. The men are broken and running for their lives. The enemy has killed our general. Oh, which one? I think that was one I bought. Well, then I'll use his, uh, his guards until they're dead. See, they're fresh and they're exhausted, so they should catch up. Right? That makes sense? I'm just making sure I was mopping up everyone here. Oh, that was so tough. See, and they're not even close to catching them. Do 
I gotta like trap them somehow? their advantage! I'm just trying to consolidate everyone so it's easier to keep track of. I can't believe I made it out of this. I only lost one general. Wow. Be good. We are moments away from victory. Wow. I mean some cheese to celebrate. Just because that was insane. What what were the odds on that battle? Sixty so about Two to four. Damn. Alright, I need to end this battle real quick and then let my cat in. She was looking at me from outside. Pyrrhic victory. Ah, yeah, right. Look at those. That was more than a Pyrrhic victory. That was a glorious best you've ever seen. I'm now I'm hyping myself up, but that was a pretty impressive victory. I have no clue how I did that. And I, I know I'm gonna lose like probably some of these troops, which sucks. <sighs> Alright, well I'm probably gonna get like what, two thousand, one thousand from ransom and release, fifteen percent from the take on warriors. Let me do that, and I hope I didn't lose those guys. They're still besieging me? What? Oh, there we go. Sorry if you hear the crunching and munching. <sighs> yep, and here comes Assassinate Stacks. Man. If I can get that force... We'll see. We'll see what I can do. I might need to just withdraw and take my prince and get him out of there. Because losing that whole force would be tough. I'd rather lose just that one city. Even though it's my capital, I'd rather lose that than lose all those guys. So we'll have to see. I need I need him, your crib. And I destroyed that faction. Bro, how are they still besieging me? At your command. Man, I lost all those fucking troops. Fuck. We fight for you, my lord. Let's see if this can get him out of here. Protective to maybe so I lose less troops. <laughs> I still lost a Oh no my god, and I'm suffering attrition now. Just because this farm was Oh, that's so annoying. That's something I didn't think of. I need to get him out of here. Ready for orders. Alright, let me... Let me look down here real quick. 
Is there anything I can do? Why did that just... I want it completely... gone. Get it out of here. Is there, there's nothing I can do with this. Did I still get those bowmen? I didn't get the bowmen because I fucking demolished the building. That is so fucking stupid. <sighs> this game. At your command. What? I have another army over here, don't I? Ready for battle. Hmm. Oh, I lost some cavalry. Or maybe I didn't. I thought I had more. But either way, I need to get them out of here. In one turn, they can all reach me. Yeah. I may lose both these cities. We fight for you, my lord. Ready for battle. Yeah, maybe I'll be forced to get pushed down this way and I'll push Axum out, maybe take some of their territory over here. I mean, I'm not in danger of complete, you know, losing everything, but... Uh, he likes Easterners? Why does he like Easterners? How did he get that trait after we just demolished them? Uh, I don't have to take so much time to recruit. Well, alright. I think I'll have to do one of these just because I have a lot of money and I need to get some public order bonuses and the uh, other bonuses it gives. Ready for orders. <sighs> Ready for battle. Damn, I'm so mad. I'm an idiot for. I mean, I'm definitely going to have a famine if I... I need to turn one of these into, like, a farm or something. I need to turn this one into a farm. This I may need to if I lose this capital, which I most likely am going to lose that capital. I need to turn this into one of the other ones. Because I'm still not getting... I'm still not getting the food I should be. 40 plus animal husbandry, plus 40 additional food. 8 per local fertility. But it says right here, I'm only making 40 or 55. Like, that's stupid. <laughs> so maybe I just need to do that right now and change it to a uh, camel herd. Of course, there's raiding, battle reports, test battle, faction destroyed. Alright. Alright, alright, alright. Let me hinder them so they can't go anywhere. I'm going to let them stay right there so it can give me a little bit public order boost. Well, I guess they're not going anywhere. Is there any mercenaries I can hire that aren't? I'll do two more slinger units. It's the best I got. It's the best I got. Alright, so... Not the end of the world. But damn, that was a massive battle. Yep, and there they go. They're going to take that. Have fun. Yeah, I don't think my guys would have been able to hold out. Not without... If they were able to replenish... Yeah. But since it, like, automatically destroys the fucking town, that's so frustrating. And it didn't even seem like they got the replenishment bonus for me taking on troops. Like, I don't know if they actually got that. And they might take Dumatha as well. Uh, maybe I should try sending peace talks their way. I don't know if I can afford to lose more cities. But 
but I doubt they'd even listen. Yeah, I know. That's there's gonna be attrition. Finally, a birth. All right, let me see if I can negotiate anything with them. You have my attention. Of course, they're number one strength. Now, do not try to charm with the Lord Kajol. For those pain, your eyes. Yeah, they're not gonna do anything until I start beating them bad. Be welcome, Emissary. Mm. Let me see if I can take. I need. I need to focus on we getting these guys. You, my lord. My lord. At your command. At your command. Ready for all. Right, now I'll take care of them. Make haste, men. I'm just gonna auto resolve this protective. Advance. I'd assume the integrity's good. Yeah. I want hourly patrols. So, give them a campaign movement range. I think the recruitment one will help. Because I may have to have him... Next turn, I'll do the food. I may have to have him switch his army off to one of these guys. Switch the whole army off and he can keep recruiting. Okay, so now, is there any of these that give a food bonus? So that's for Eastern Christianity. That's for Zoroasterism. That's a lead deposit. It's recruitment waterworks, which will help. Public order and sanitation. No, none of them. None of them do. Where do I go to see the building browser? So here we go, food trader. That's what I need to get. So I need to do a plaza, bazaar, food trader. I already have that. So maybe I can do something else with them. I mean, that'll give me 80 food once that's done. So maybe it would finally be time for me to start pushing Zoroasterism so I can convert to that. Even though it's not gonna line up perfect. The famine will be fixed next turn when this is completed. We fight for you, my but I want to make sure I have plenty of food. I guess I could have done that here for a long time as well. Maybe I'll do that anyways so I can upgrade some of these other settlements. I don't know. Well, I'm going to take it one turn at a time. I don't want to spend all my money. Is there anything I can give him to boost them? Not that it's worth it. So that gave me upkeep minus two. Downward construction costs. Okay. The Library and Magistrate's Palace. Let me see what those give me. Oh, I don't have a bazaar there. It was over here. So that must be on the other skill tree for the Civic City Center. So Courthouse, which is a public order boost. That's a faction, or that's a research boost. It's public order boost and, and lots of champions. Oh, I could use a champion too. All right. Oh no, that's not yet. It's Magistrate's Palace. Which one was that? Was that in the town center? Yeah, it is. Well, I need to get there eventually to get the uh, champion. What other... I can only recruit spies right now. How may I serve you? Your orders, my lord. I am here. What can you do to the settlement? Not much. Not worth it. Hinder army. Gather intelligence, 55%. Success. There we go. And then he just needs two more authority. 
So let's give him one more there. And then next authority, I think he gets down here. Yeah, so that might be a while. But maybe he'll get something. He'll get a household item or something. Okay. I can't do anything with these guys. I may need to adopt more. Because he's starting to get a lot of... Which one of these generals do I like more? There's Jaffna, and then I think this is the new one, is your creep. Jaffna must be this guy over here. I'll wait until they show, until which one proves themselves to be better to adopt, then. I think for right now, the best thing I could do is embezzle funds. But I don't really need money, so I'll just keep banking his uh, influence. Alright, alright. I have so much money, but I need stuff to spend it on. Yep, and there goes that city. Don't worry, everyone. I will take this stuff back. I will take it back. Damn, I just can't believe how many stacks they have. Holy shit. Holy shit. What? One, two, three, four, five. And then one just ran off screen. Yeah, I need to get rid of them and I need to secure. We make this modest request in the knowledge that your coffers strain to contain your wealth. Well, why? I, it would take me. It would take me 20 turns for that to be worth paying you 3,000. I'll do 2,000 max. You speak oh, well. Boo-hoo. Fucking... 3,000? Are you insane? Oh, and there comes Judea. Alright. Well, now time to rebuild. <laughs> I can't because they don't have a recruitment thing here. I need to get the growth up here. Growth's probably so slow, yeah. <sighs> Why is it still showing me this settlement, though? Shouldn't that be in, like, the Fog of War? I guess I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna have to start recruiting another army here. Is there anybody else I can? Oh, is that that's what it's pulling from? Well, I'm gonna go with the younger guy then. Ready for battle. And Come start with some rights. spearmen. And then yeah, I'll need to I'll need to make an infantry quarter so I can so I can recruit more of the actual levy swordsmen and the bow the archers. At your service. Ready for orders. Oh, we fight for you, my lord. My lord. Yeah, I need to let them heal. Can I make peace with Judea? Am I always to be disturbed by foreigners? If uh, it is arms you want, talk to my major domo. I just don't want to have to deal with another fucking stack. Peace. Yeah. What do they got? Heavy spears, all that stuff. Ready for orders. You. 
I'm just going to disband you for now. I'll have to recruit you again and have you spawn over here. And then hopefully... This garrison can hold. Hoping. Yeah. I think I'll do one more turn and see how this plays out. Okay, perfect, perfect. They're abandoning the city. And they're sending their king and their armies out to suffer attrition at sea. What I ask is such a little thing, an no, inconsequential thing. thing, that I almost hesitate to mention the amount. 2100. Yeah, not gonna do it. Why did you just... Okay, whatever. I mean, they're kind of coming to my help. They're attacking the Axum troops. Which is pretty clutch. Yep, and they're like, oh my god, damn, dude, cut me a break. Oh, this is so frustrating. <laughs> I swear I saw a second stack come my up. Lord. I'll have to get some mercenaries. Just to, just to help buff it out, but this might actually be easy. Because I can just come right in here and take it. And I think I'm just going to do that. Laying siege to the settlement. I'm just going to auto-resolve it. Aggressive. Occupy. Okay. I can demolish that. And I think I'll repair this. And then I need to start building a city there. Ready for battle. Ready for orders. They're not going to be able to do anything if they attack. Let me do two more desert spears on them. And I'm going to upgrade this city too. My lord. Because I'm going to get. 80 food from here in two turns. I'm going to get some food from the fields down here. Ready for battle. Jaffna, I think I'm just going to have you sit here for now because you're probably the next target. It's either going to be you or this capital. And then in one turn, or no, Two more turns for the infantry quarters. I shouldn't have demolished that. I don't know what I was thinking. My lord. It might just be worth it to have you. you my lord. That's a huge mercenary army. The victory! Yeah, get back in there. Set up the, watch. the mercenary camel warriors I'll have to keep. I think I'll get rid of. Wrong button. I think I'll get rid of them. I did that just in case they'd actually Are you ready to serve? let me fight. Ready for orders. I know one. Sabotage. As you order. Critical failure, nice. Awesome. Alright, now I'm thinking that's probably a good spot to end it. This is enough of a force that I should be able to beat them. 
really could use more desert bowmen down here. But I'm still making money. I don't know how he's a procrastinator. Yeah. So I think that's it for this episode. Lost a lot of land, but was able to secure down here. And maybe I'll need to... No, I think I'll keep the religion, religious influence and stuff. Well... I don't want the... I don't want Eastern Christianity to keep moving. So maybe I will have to change that. I don't know. I'll figure all that out on the next turn. But, leave a comment. Let me know if you guys liked this video, what you thought. If there's anything you think I've done wrong, which I think there's a lot I've done wrong so far, please let me know. But. I've enjoyed this episode. That was a crazy battle. I'm going to have to make sure I rewatch that. Uh, let me know what you guys thought, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.